again proves it. You know, that was a, two weeks ago. A lot of people are thinking about it at the time of, you know, you, I'm, I'm imagining that people go to an event, they come back, their boss might go, did you get any leads from it? Yeah. Like, well, maybe not in the two hours that I spent there, but I developed relationships and in six months time that might work out to be yeah. hugely yeah. beneficial. So again, it's just applying that longer term thinking to it. And that will depend on what kind of product or service you're, you, you have. Um, is it something that people need in the moment? Mm -hmm. So they, they, uh, they don't, might not necessarily have had any engagement with your, your brand before, but they are searching, they find an article, they see a tweet, that's what they need, they act then and there. Mm -hmm. um, or is it the kind of thing where it's all about trust? So consultancy, for example, it's, probably, it's all about trust and that's something it takes a long time to build. Yeah. So you, you tend not to see, it's not that someone Googles uh, you know, process consultancy, and then the first result that comes up they, they engage with, yeah. um, they'll, they'll, they'll read the articles, they'll search for quite a lot of things, and, then, and maybe they've been in the background aware of something on LinkedIn, but it was never relevant to them until that moment when it was. Yes. And yeah. then it, it, the penny drops. Yeah. And so, but but that, that's sector-based, that's industry-based. So I think your, your KPIs need to reflect that. But I think that's, a, that's an important point as well, just to that someone might not be in the, at the right stage in the buying cycle when they engage with your content the first time around, but then s down the line when they do suddenly have that need for that service, mm -hmm. it's all that good stuff you've been putting out there that keeps your company front of mind for it. Mm -hmm.